6.40 a.m. We decided last night that we were gonna go to Simala. John told me he wanted to go as well. And so we're going today. We're on our way there. It's an hour and 30 minutes drive going to Simala Shrine. I'll take you guys with us as we go there. John driving us on our way there. Parking fee of 40 pesos. I'm still sleeping. I slept for about 30 to 40 minutes on our way here. John will put on his sunblock. The church is over there. And then had to go left to park. We're just gonna walk right there in the area. I'll take you guys to that. We're now here. We'll go inside and we'll let you know there are Korean and restaurants. If you zoom right there. There's a lot of people. This is the proper attire. Proper attire and then improper. No tube tops, no hanging top, no leggings. Let's go inside. Thanksgiving and then gold for healing and violet for achievement. Gold, green, blue, violet, uh, red, pink. Gold, green, blue, violet, red, and pink.
visiting the Simala Shrine. We were able to write our petitions. We also did the mass intentions. And we also bought six different colored candles. We visited the church. It was still under renovation. There's a lot, a lot, a lot of people going here, especially since today is a Sunday. And we also had to remove our shoes. We also weren't able to do the halok or that's kissing of the miraculous Mama Mary because there's a lot of people and you know especially with the current coronavirus it's better that we avoid it the most important thing about going here is that it's not about kissing Mama Mary or about taking pictures the important thing here is give thanks to the Lord and you also ask for guidance in life what can you say love? it's a good feeling to be there we're driving back to the city. We're gonna have lunch. Then later this afternoon, we are going to another Cebu tourist spot that is in Sirao. So that is it.